Hi, I'm Peter Allen and I'm on the men's tennis team. I'm a junior and I'm studying finance. Alrighty, so tell me about looking forward to the 22-23 season. Um, talk to me a little bit about the fall that, that you had so far and then let's look forward into the spring. What are you looking forward to for this season, um, conference season with your team for yourself? Yeah, I think um, this fall has been, if you compare it to the last one, it's been much better. Um, the team's more, uh, more united, more together. I think last year we didn't really know each other and this year we've just been more, just more together in general, working hard, uh, more bigger roster, um, and I think in general better results and just the, there's a more positive feeling going into the spring, um, which personally is is exciting because uh, we we didn't really know what to expect last uh, last spring, whereas this time I think we have a much better idea as a team. We know we're more clear about our goals, and uh, hopefully we can have a good season. And what are those goals for maybe you have some for yourself, maybe you guys have some as a team for the spring? Yeah, uh, well, we want to obviously uh, get to the conference tournament. Um, and it, honestly, I think we can win it. Like with the talent we have and also the talent we have coming in, I think our team is like pretty stacked um, in all positions in the lineup. So uh, it's, just about, it's just about us bringing it uh, every time. Um, and we'll do well, I think, yeah. So what's kind of been the message in the locker room? Um, it can come from Robin, it can come from your captains, it can come from yeah. anybody. What's kind of been the discussions for y'all in the locker room looking forward to the spring? Yeah, I think it's, it's just more about bringing, like making sure that once we get out on the court and once we leave the court, there's, we can say that we lost. If we lost, then we lost because we, we just weren't good enough on the day. Like we don't want to be losing anything, any matches uh, with, uh, like controllables, you know, like bringing energy, intensity, uh, competitiveness, like all of that stuff, um, like fighting for each other. Um, we want to make sure that that is like on lock every time. Uh, we always, always bring it 100% in terms of that side of the game. Uh, and then the tennis, that, that's stuff we can work on. Um, but even there, like I think we're, we've improved so much as a team. I know personally, I've, I feel like this semester in terms of my game has, has gone really well. Um, and yeah, hopefully we can carry on and even improve it in the spring. So what do you think is, is there a particular match, a particular game, maybe there's two, on your season that you are like, you can't wait for this one? Um, I think in general, we're just more excited to have uh, a lot more home, home matches this, uh, this spring, whereas last semester we kind of traveled a lot, which is fun, but it's like, there's nothing like playing at home. And even last semester we played uh, the ones we did play at home, we like we had a fairly decent record, and it's just way more fun in general uh, with the home crowd and stuff, and uh, home courts more, feel more comfortable. So we're definitely looking forward to playing more at home, uh, and then I think just testing ourselves against the best teams. Like uh, the last match last spring was against San Diego, and we pushed them right to the end. I think honestly we can even we can go one one better and beat them, and not just them, like the ranked teams like. Pepperdine as well so yeah every match I think but we shouldn't approach it like that we should approach every match the same like uh, so we can't slack off against like on paper weaker teams because we haven't done anything yet so we have to look at ourselves as uh, not the underdogs but like we haven't done anything and we, we need to we have something to prove I think in this conference so yeah and you touched on about how much more you enjoy playing at home and you touched on the fans. Tell me kind yeah. of what your message is to those fans that come out that enjoy this beautiful tennis facility, but what would your kind of inviting message be to them to come and watch you guys play this spring? Yeah, I think just try and get out and just try and get out in numbers and uh, we, we, are, we love it when the fans are, here, of, are attending the matches, like, it makes us feel more at home makes us want to not just fight for each other but fight for the fans uh, and also the university in general. Um, it just creates a better atmosphere and uh, it always helps us. It's like a, an, extra, an extra player on the team almost. So try to get out in numbers and uh, we'll make it count. What would you say is kind of, you know, you did mention the conference tournament so maybe that's it, but is that kind of the, the main goal, the only goal or there? Is there a goal for yourself, a goal for the team? Yeah, uh, yeah I think 
obviously we didn't like make the tournament last semester, but uh, so obviously the first step should be to make it. But we really like believe we can win it um, based on the matches we played in the last spring. I think we can if we just apply ourselves every time we can we can really do uh, well in that one. So and then if we do that, then obviously we make the NCAA tournament and win, uh, if we win the conference. So that's like that'll be great. That'll be that's really exciting if we can do that. But it takes takes work in one match at a time and then yeah individually I just I'd like to get ranked I think that'll be a good good next step because I played pretty high in the lineup last uh, last year and I did I did well against but I didn't I wasn't quite there so if I can get to the next step and beat some of these guys and get ranked then that'll be perfect. Alrighty well I think we covered most of it is there anything about this upcoming season yourself the team's goals that we haven't touched on that you want to add? I don't think so, no. I think uh, that's all. Yeah. All righty. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, no problem.